John Reagan Elementary School was built in 1907 as a six-room schoolhouse. Today, it's old, difficult to heat and cool, hard to keep clean, and rather drab. Some of the more than 400 children who go to school here have to contend with steep stairways without safety railings. One class of kindergartners meets in the basement amongst exposed pipes, peeling paint, and bare light bulbs. The school gymnasium is the size of a classroom. Sometimes as many as 40 kids are packed into it. Last week, the floor in the boys' restroom had to be ripped up. A steam pipe broke. And during heavy rains, it floods so badly in the basement that the school installed pumps in the lunchroom to drain the gym and the cafeteria. The plans are to build two new schools to replace Reagan and two other turn-of-the-century schools nearby. About 100 schools stand to benefit if the school improvements bonds are passed tomorrow. Those opposed to the bonds say they can't really trust the school district to use the money where it's really needed. But those familiar with schools, like John Reagan here, say they can't afford not to fix it up. Betty Hoover, Channel 8 News.